Economic values of reefs. Coral reefs are an important part of the ocean life, being home to about 25% of all marine life. They are a large source of traction, and they bring income to many families who come out, like fishermen and other tourist jobs and stuff. As you can see, tourism and recreation bring in the most money each year, which is almost $10 billion. The next is coastal protection, fishery, and biodiversity. If we didn't have the coral reefs, all this money would be gone and more people would lose a job and be in debt, which wouldn't help our country. What is coral bleaching? Coral have algae living in their tissues, and when they are stressed by either temperature or light changes, they expel them, causing them to turn into bleach and turn completely white. And now they've lost nutrition, so they're going to be more weaker and more open for diseases to strike. This is also causing half the coral population to die after bleaching. It's a big issue. Since global warming has been uh, rising in temperature in the atmosphere, it's also making ocean temperatures rise. This is causing a lot of coral bleach more than what's supposed to be. The main reason for bleaching. A huge bleaching event occurred in 2005 in the Caribbean, causing half the coral population to bleach and most of them to die. And more bleaching events have occurred in the Caribbean since then, getting larger and larger. This is a big issue because, as you can see, the islands who depend on tourists to come and see the coral have now lost a lot of income. And like these little islands right here, who are in the severe bleaching area, most of the coral there are now dead. Now fish and wildlife have no home or protection either because of coral and rock. How to stop it. My proposal is that we need to stop carbon dioxide emissions in the atmosphere because that's the main reason why corals are bleaching. The carbon dioxide in the atmosphere is causing the temperature to rise, which means the ocean temperature is rising also. We can't completely stop carbon dioxide emissions because carbon dioxide is a natural substance that has to be in the atmosphere, but we do need to limit it to make sure a good amount is safe. In order to stop it, we can't stop factories and cars from producing it, but we can make laws to limit it. And also we can have more people drive electric cars instead of gas pumps. So that way there's less stress on the fall when the temperature is rising, right, no bleaching. Even though bleaching is a natural but the amount that we're experiencing right now is a natural and we need to figure out a solution to stop it. It is a solution. More info on coral bleaching is at these websites where I got most of my ideas from. And also you can figure out ways to donate money to um, places that are helping save the corals from bleaching and putting them on their own